Hey friends, welcome back to Bitfumes. I'm your host Sarthak and you can also call me Ankur. In this episode, we are going to learn about how to include CSS file or JS file in your system. Actually, we have done using CDN method, but in this episode, we are actually making a file and storing it in a folder and then we will use that file. Okay, for starting, I will go to my resource and view. Here, I will go and create a folder called file and in this folder i want to create a home.blade.php okay now i will just create a html5 markup okay now here i will type hello bitfumes okay now it's good and just quickly connect this to our route so i will go to my web and I will not use a controller I will just use closer and what is closer that means you just have to type the URL and return the view in the same section let's see what I am doing I am doing here file that means when the user go to this URL that means the base URL slash file then I will create a function then this function will called and here i will just return view view name is obviously inside file dot home and let's see is that working or not for that i have to open my command prompt okay now go to that folder where i have installed this laravel php artisan serve now server is started okay let's go and go to my server and obviously we don't have any home page so that's giving an error now go to file and let's see yeah hello bitfumes so now as i want to include a css file what i can do i can just use bootstrap cdn so i will go there and in this website i will just copy this link tag and paste this link tag in our page and yep and let's see the result and you can see the font has been changed that means the bootstrap css is working fine but we don't want that cdn we want a local file for that i will just open this file in my browser and copy all the contents of here and now listen carefully now i will go to public folder and in the CSS folder, these two CSS folder and these some of the files are already created by the Laravel. So in the CSS folder, make a new file called bootstrap.css and paste all these code here. Okay. Now I have to go my home.blade.php. I will delete this link tag. Here I will say link and now slash css slash bootstrap dot css and now refresh the page and you will see there is no error that means our css file is working fine so let's just quickly view source and here is the file now click the file and you can see this file is here so we have seen that how we can easily connect our css file similarly you can just include your Mm, js file so let's go here and obviously you can copy the same link but we don't want the cdn file so i will go there and i will open this file i will copy all these things and again i will go to js folder here i will create bootstrap.js paste all these things and go to home create a script tag and a script in the script tag i will say source is equal to slash js slash bootstrap dot js now click refresh obviously we can't see anything so we have to go to page source and here is that click that link and you can find all these here so when i turn off my internet connection then also this will work because we have locally attached the file that means the css file and the js files okay so you have seen that it's very cool and it's very much easy uh, i don't think you have any doubt but 
obviously if you have any doubt you can feel free to comment me i will surely surely respond to your question so we will meet in the next episode till then bye